Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to our daily tune-up today. You know, many people always ask me about their memory. They say their memory is slipping them. They have a hard time remembering things sometimes. There's a couple of things that are probably causing that. It could be nutritional. You know, sugar is a big part of that. But one of the other things is, is lack of using your mind. I know a lot of us are slammed with too many things to do. We're busy, we're just absolutely in crisis mode. One thing leads to another and by the time the day is over we're so exhausted we have no energy to do anything. How many times do I hear that? And I'm sure you're aware of that yourself sometimes. One of the things I want you to understand about the way your mind works is the more you exercise it, the better it works. If you don't lose it, you're going to lose it. So you've got to use it and use it wisely. Keep in mind, if you just rest on the things that you know by not expanding your mind, by learning new things, by exploring new things, or even doing very, very hard puzzles, whether they're mental puzzles, mathematical puzzles, or putting a physical puzzle together, your mind will have a tendency to atrophy on you. You're going to start resting on the laurels of what you already know, and pretty soon your ability to expand it gets more difficult and more difficult and more difficult. One of the greatest things you can do to really expand your mind is to work on learning a new language. And even if you want to take language courses or don't want to, just immersing yourself into another society that uses possibly Spanish or German, you're going to be forced to learn those things. That's why going on a trip and being dumped into a culture like Italy or France and being forced to communicate with those people is really good for mind expansion. But well, you can do it right here where you live by really forcing the issue of communicating with people who do not speak the same language you do. Also, another thing you can do is put down the calculator and start doing math in your head or start doing it with a piece of paper and a pencil. Remember that? We all used to be able to do that. So expanding our memory has a lot to do with using your mind. And using your mind is fun if you want it to be. It doesn't all have to be work. You can find ways to expand it that are recreational. So stretch yourself a little bit. Quit complaining about you can't remember things and understand there's only one way to remember things as that's to use the tool that remembers things and to expand it, to work it, and make it work for you. Until tomorrow, this is Dr. Gary wishing you an extraordinary mindful day. Bye-bye.